Hello everyone, welcome to Prime Project Control. Wish you happy new year 2024. In this lecture, I'll be doing a cost loading directly from Excel to the PS6. This is uh, this procedure is done in case where you have BOQ cost bill of quantities. BOQ means bill of quantities. The cost is already distributed with to the activities of project, and this cost has to be loaded into the PS6. Usually, in normal method, the cost is calculated in the PS6 with the help of the assigned resources such as labor or material, and it is multiplied into the quantity or duration then you will have the cost loaded program in the basics in this case what i'm going to do is i'll be just directly importing the cost from boq excel into the p6 the cost is distributed as per the boq which will help in tracking the cost progress in p6 let me go through the step-by-step -step process in how to do that firstly we will have it clearly developed to schedule in the p6 once the schedule is done, then we'll create a I'll create a resources for cost loading. There is a certain uh, aspect need to consider the unit rate on all. So after creating resources, I'll assign this created resource to all the activities which require cost loading. Once the resource is assigned, then I'll export this schedule into Excel format following certain export conditions which I'll show you after the schedule is exported into, exported into the Excel I'll refer to the BUQ distributed cost sheet then copy the cost already distributed in the, from the BUQ I'll paste the cost uh, into the P6 exported Excel sheet so once the cost is transferred from BUQ to the P6 Excel I'll re-import back the P6 Excel into the P6. Once I do that, I'll be uh, putting up the condition to update. So it's a cost loaded program, bulk update of the cost loaded program. Let us go to the uh, P6 program now to do the step-by-step -step process. We have uh, two files, which is one is uh, labor cost loaded. This is uh, a traditional way of uh, cost loading where a uh, labor um, cost per hour is distributed to the activities uh, into the duration then we'll have a total cost here save uh, the total cost from the budgeted labor since there is no material cost so it is become the budgeted total cost whereas I'm not interested in this because I want to upload a cost directly from BOQ so I'll be opening up this file where there's no uh, labor cost associated uh, there is no resource assigned as well so you can see I've uh, designed build foundation structure mechanical uh, exterior interior finishes I'll expand it again so I'll go to the resources there are no resources associated with this project now so what I'll do is I'll go to the resources and I'll create a resource I'll just copy this or I'll create one more add cost will uh, is the resource ID under material then you have to select the dollar icon and it is uh, very important to see the units per time so the default uh, units per time is 8 per day so it's uh, it has to be changed to 1 per day so you have selected the unit of measure okay and the resources is created now let me go back to the cost loading v go to the activity 
add a column resources under general select control F to find the resources okay under list select resources place it here so the resource column is here instead of uh, assigning resources individually here like add resources instead of doing it one by one what you could do is just select entire column from top to bottom all that you just click right click then select resources then assign that's all very straightforward where you can notice the resource is assigned but you have a double assignment here so you go back to your just remove double assignment so i'll remove the budgeted labor cost because i'll be importing it as a material cost okay now let me export this into excel to export go to the file click export select a spreadsheet click next select activities resources resource assignment select the file which is going to be exported into excel here you need to make sure that under um, resource assignment you have this both uh, resources and budgeted units if you want to sort it out you can sort it out by order just add the wbs then ascending click ok then next then i'll be saving in the desktop ec cost load click next click finish so after exporting into the excel go to the desktop under ec cost load open this excel so you can see the um, under task these activities and this activity ID is having resources cost loaded this is with only resource name and id so we'll go to the resource uh, assignment that is task resources you have uh, activity name activity id and uh, some cost i'll make this cost as zero now so it's all zero now what i'll do is if you see the activities and activity ids only with having the resources resources id it has been uh, displayed here so with the help of your queue uh, you can identify the ids or activity name and you could copy paste the cost into this excel uh, it's uh, as simple as like copying and pasting suppose uh, we have uh, like thousand dollars for all these activities i'll just add thousand to simplify i'm doing it quicker way um, it is it is same pattern that you can just copy the cost and paste it here after pasting this this is important you should know that this num these are stored in the number you have to convert this stored number into text value so go to the data and find this text to two columns select this text to columns select this delimited 
and select comma then you select this um, single comma then click next then here you select text that's all finish so if you see number stored as text so all these are stored as text what i'll do is i'll save this control s so i'll go to the p6 again import the excel go to this one will have cost select the file next click all this next then update existing project yes we are updating the existing project so select the project once it is done you can notice the cost is being loaded you could see that all those activities i loaded with thousand dollars has been input into this so this is quite simple and fastest way of doing thank you that's how simple it was uh, direct import of course from excel to the psx we'll see you in the next uh, lecture till then take care bye